Hello, this is Brother Andrew. Um, I'd like to show you how to use XAMPP. Um, basically, if you're trying to use our HTML5 games, you can edit those in two different ways. One is to put them on a web server and then access the config HTML page and edit them that way. But if you don't have access to a web server, or if you'd like to use your desktop, your local machine, as a web server, you can use something called XAMPP. So basically, let's do this. Um, go out to Google and just Google XAMPP. And then it brings up this right here, Apache Friends. And you'd want to click on that and then download the appropriate installer for your machine. It's probably XAMPP for Windows or, um, or for Mac. So you go ahead and download that. Now, once you've downloaded and installed it, let me show you how to use it. All right, so on your C drive, and I'm on a PC right now, so on your C drive, you'll see a new folder called XAMPP. And within there, you'll see an htdocs. So this kind of mimics a server. So if you were on a web server, you would see an htdocs folder also. Um, and in the htdocs, that's where you put all of your folders that you want to access through your browser. So basically what we're trying to do is upload all of our HTML5 games here into this htdocs folder. We'll access it through a server and make all the changes that you need to in edits for your game. So you can see here, I've created a folder called game. And then in there, I put in the core folder and then I loaded a couple games. I put boot camp, golf, and world race in there. And then I put another world race and I called it number two so I could have a separate instance of it. Now within boot camp, you can see there's your config HTML file. That's the one that you would access to edit the files. Now if you haven't already, make sure you view the video tutorial called Getting Started with HTML5 Games and it will show you how to edit those. I'm just going to show you how to pull them up here in XAMPP. All right, so now that you did that, what you also need to do is go ahead and launch XAMPP. And in the control panel for XAMPP, the only thing that you need running is Apache. So you just click on that checkbox there and click Start and just run Apache. That's the only service that you need running right now. All right, now let me show you how to pull up your game now. So basically, the browser, and in your URL, go HTTP colon forward slash forward slash and then put local host and then that will get that basically gets you into the HT docs folder and then you need to reconstruct your URL from that point on so as you can see in mine right I put in a folder there in HT docs called game so you can see I have game written up here in the URL and then inside of game I have boot camp you see you have boot camp right here and then I went into the config HTML page and that got me basically to this game editor here for the uh, for the game. And then I could come in here, right, just like it shows you in the tutorial video. Oops. I could come in here and I could just type in, type in my text, come down here and click save and reload the game. All right, so that's how you use XAMPP. The important part here, though, is remember, you've got to get your game folders in XAMPP. So on your C drive, XAMPP, and then htdocs. So put them in there. And then to access them through your browser, remember you go http colon slash slash localhost. And then you can you know basically put in whatever folders you created at that point. Alright, that's it.